Hey everybody, it's Jordan with PDQ, and we're back for our 10th Paths Tuesday of the year, which makes it October, because it's the 10th month. That's the way monthly updates work. And I gotta tell you, Microsoft brought their A game. They were concerned all this lib WebP was taking the shine. It's like, oh, zero day, I was worried about that. So they came in strong. They came in with 104 patches total, 12 critical, and five of those that have already been known or exploited. Uh, but if I'm being honest about it, looking through it, uh, I, I feel like Mar Microsoft is doing uh, some shifty numbers to try to up their game, and they're not competing. But we'll kind of break down what's going in there. Uh, overall, there's two 9.8s, and we'll go into each one of those. The first one, we know this one, we love this one. I think this is like the seventh messaging queue, critical 9.8 vulnerability found this year. It's always the same service, the same everything. This is an outdated service and most people don't use it, which is why it's not considered as bad because it's an uncommon service. But, and in, even the fix has not changed outside of patching. If you're using that queue service, check on the machine that has it. If the service is running and it is lis listening on port 1801, you're at risk. Uh, so go ahead and either change the port you're listening to, redo the service or upgrade to something that's more relevant. That one's been all year. All year that one's come back again and again so maybe messaging queue is time to to move on to other services the windows is server is a 9.8 but it's listed as important instead of critical we'll go into why in just a bit uh, and this one is an elevation of privilege for is uh the reason it's rated so low is because it is basically a brute force attack so they consider that less at risk it's not good to have you definitely want to get that patched but brute force especially if you have complex passwords not so easy to take advantage of. So 9.8, yes, not so bad, but still IIS, anything running that, patch it right now. The last one we're covering, it's a, little, it's a 5.3. The reason I covered this one is it felt like the worst of the already known and exploited patches. And this is a Skype for business elevation of privilege. Uh, the way this one works is basically they send a request there and it will return back uh, IP address and port. So it doesn't help them get into anything, but it gives them critical information to help them get into something. So while that's lower on the threat scale, the fact that it's already published and known and has already been exploited, that's one you want to take care of. And that's kind of everything for Patch Tuesday in this year. 104 seemed bad, 12 critical sounds bad, but honestly, it feels like they're just trying too hard to uh, keep up with the zero days and they failed. Uh, for PDQ, I'm Jordan.